I got access to this new tool, which is absolutely incredible for making motions, graphics, really cool charts. Let me show you. It is called Dora Studio, and I'll have a link in the description below if you want to join the waiting list. You can click this big yellow button. It took me probably about a week, but you can see here that little chart that I just made or create an animated table. So it is making this actual animation itself, and it will make the entire animation for you, and they all look really nice. So here are some of the examples that they give. So like a chat animation or a sales trend you can actually see the trend being animated and you can see it here you can have it zoom into different parts of the world and it will highlight it blue so if you ever see those like little cool motion graphics that people use on youtube videos yeah this can make those we have this cool pie chart or this really cool text animation once you get accepted you're going to get access to their discord where we're going to go through the examples that other users have submitted and we're going to look at how well it works outside of the examples they have on their website because you know these websites these apps generally cherry pick the best possible examples let's see how it really performs and before i do that i want to remind you to click the subscribe button i cover ai on a daily basis so you can stay up to date with the latest and greatest ai you can can see the prompt here and you can like pause the video and look at it but here is what it created it was basically to make a sustainable living slideshow and this is the slideshow that it made from a single prompt so it's like 17 seconds it has all the different slides it kind of goes through and animates it all it looks pretty good generate a sleek dark blue chart showing how the largest car markets in the world adopted ev cars so we can kind of see exactly what it created and we can see EV markets, we can see the graph. It looks pretty spectacular, really sharp. And again, this is an AI model that is able to generate all this. We have the evolution of the most common disaster recovery risks in Europe. And I just can't get over how cool these charts are. It has the year in the bottom right. We have colored bars. Can it be quicker? Yes, I think that would kind of bring it up a level to make it a little nicer. The average gold price versus the change per year. And that animation is awesome. You can see the little effect go through the golden bars. Amazing. Oh, and then it fades out even better. Generate a moving glitchy pattern of text with the word VSL with an animation gradient pink background, pink and green background with the text that is black. So this is what it came up with and it does look kind of glitchy. You can see the background go from pink to green. It kind of obeyed and did everything. Cryptocurrencies over time. So we can see Bitcoin at the top. You can kind of see the other ones going through. I love these charts. We have Canada's GDP from 2004 to 2023. So there's something important I want to note about all of this stuff. So that when you go to create these, you have to use like slash create on Discord. And then you say, hey, this is what I want you to create. But you also have the ability to upload your own file. So the Canada's GDP one, for example, I'm not exactly sure if the numbers are accurate or not. But if you go and use this tool and you upload your own data, you can be sure that the numbers and the values will be real. I think this tool is really cool, especially for creating graphs like this. Like I think that looks so sleek and it's just so simple. The text animations are pretty good, I guess. They're not like spectacular, but they're good enough. We have this one here, which does a motion graphic showing the map of the US and then highlighting the following states and showing a pop-up number on top of them. So we have like five, Kentucky, one, Florida, it just kind of goes through a list and you want to make it go till it's complete. So you can actually see it does work. It pops up each state with the number on each state. It made this little animation of someone uploading a CSV file, which was pretty cool. And it created like a whole little user interface after. While this tool is really cool, there are a couple of downsides. So you can put through a prompt that makes a lot of sense that matches other things that this tool has already created, like an animated map, but just in satellite view, and you want it to start with Florida in frame and then zoom out into a larger view of Florida. And you'd think, hey, this would make a lot of sense that this tool can do, but every once in a while, you're gonna get this message that says this has been declined as it's out of the scope of what the tool can do. And it does that a lot. And when I say it happens a lot, if you go to the bugs channel, the very first comment is hilarious. Everything is out of scope. And the other issue with this tool is time. It takes a very long time for it to generate any of your requests. They say that they are trying to scale up the servers, that it is early beta, and they hope to have it much faster in the near future. 
But hey, everything is completely free during this early phase. So go sign up for the beta, hopefully you get it, and you can have some fun with this tool. Let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you're interested in AI content. The majority of you watching this aren't subscribed already, so go do it, click the subscribe button, and like the video, it tells the algorithm you wanna see more content like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow with another AI video. You're meant to be